Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, dear listeners, from wherever you have tuned into this channel all over the world. Welcome to Verdict TV. Just in, two politicians resigned from top seat in APC. Got Nigerians talking. See who they are and why. Thank you for tuning in to this news. But please subscribe by clicking on the subscribe button and the bell for more updates. To the news details, please listen carefully to the end. Senator Abdullahi Adambu, who was the national chairman of the All Progressives Congress, APC, is said to have quit his job. Adamu has been having a lot of problems since the party won a contested presidential election on February 25, 2023. The results of the election are being disputed by the main opposition parties and their leaders, such as Peter Ruby of the Labour Party LP and Atiku Habubaka of the People's Democratic Party PDP. Adamu and Omishori's resignation has have been called for by top members of the APC. On Sunday night, the, the, the news got confirmation from unknown, unnamed sources in the APC and the presidency that President Bola Tinubu told Adamu to step down. Adamu's time in office had been full of strife. On July 17, he set up a meeting of the National Workings Committee, NWC, to prepare for meetings of the CACOS and National Executive Committee, NEC, on July 18 and 19. No one knows what will happen next with these talks. Before, these same talks were moved from last week to July 17, 18 and 19 because of disagreements and policies within the party. Sources said that the NWC and the president did not have a clear plan for these talks, so they were put off. Adamu is blamed for this lack of direction. Reports also show that the NWC as a whole agrees that both the national chairman and his secretary should be forced to quit. Also, this is apparently the satisfaction over what is said to be ambiguity in the party's 2022 account audits, which was done and sent without any of the members reading it. In spite of the fights within the ruling All Progressives Congress, APC, Senator Abdullahi Adamu, the party's leader, said it does not dislike President Bola Tenumbu. This is what Adamu said in an interview on Arise TV on Tuesday. He said, at least we made this party successful and we can't change that. Tenumbu was made by the APC and I had the honor of being in charge of it. Just so you know, I've had a good working relationship with President Ahmed Tenumbu, GCFR, ever since he took office. Since he was elected, there's nothing I've gone to him to talk about and I have not been able to get his attention or get my point across. So, these are people who just talk about me and my boss and try to make trouble between us. He isn't just that. He runs the Federal Republic of Nigeria as its leader. I feel lucky to be the leader of the party in power today. We call that the APC chairman had warned party leaders not to get their hopes up that Tinubu would make them ministers, saying that everyone cannot be in the cabinet. Adamu also explained why the president's ministers and head of ministries, departments, and agencies had not been named yet by saying that Tinumbu was consulting with a lot of people before making an official statement. An unnamed source 
has disclosed that the APC national chairman and his secretary quitted their job as the national chairman as the sec and the secretary that it was Tinubu that forced them to quit. So now Adamu is saying that he has no issue with President Bola Tinubu. He has worked with him and there's nothing he asks for him that he will not get the attention of the president. But if need be, he needs to resign. And he feels lucky that he's the leader of the party that is in, a, is in power today. He has had good working relationship with, with President Tinubu. And at least they made the party successful. And they can't change that. So the, the unnamed person who gave the source is from APC. But President has not said anything concerning that. But it was confirmed that the president told Adamu to step down. And since Adamu is stepping down, his secretary too needs to step down. We have come to the end of the news. Thank you for tuning in to the end.